What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back, and guys, we are here with the roster update prediction. Um, let's get this video to 100 likes, and we will give away 10k. Uh, drop a comment, any comment. Make sure you like the vid. Let's get it to 100 likes. If you get, if you like the vid, somebody will earn 10,000 stubs. So just like the vid. So. Guys, roster update predictions, okay? These videos have been absolutely amazing for me. Um, everybody loves my predictions, and honestly, all my predictions are usually right. So I'm going to go through it, and I'm going to tell you guys who I think is going to get upgraded. So I'm basing these stats over the last two weeks, okay? I think over the last two weeks is the best way to do stat stats. So that's exactly what we're going to do. So let's start it off. Mike Trout has been the best player over the last two weeks. Does he get an upgrade? I think Trout goes to a 96, guys. It might sound crazy, but I really think it's going to happen. And guys, don't forget, we have a stream tonight at 9.15. Every day, Monday through Thursday, a stream. Your boy Bug 16 is the Twitch. Do not forget, we are streaming every day, Monday through Thursday, 9.15. Do not forget. And next up, Corey Seager. He's looking pretty deadly and he's at 1200 stubs what does he go to probably back to his 83 and 1200 stubs is probably the best price possible another upgrade david Dahl. everybody's been talking about him as you can see his price went up a ton and if you could somehow snag one for 600 stubs you're valid um he's been absolutely amazing he is 21 for 53 21 hits 13 uh, singles, five doubles, two dingers, 11 ribbies, four walks versus eight Ks. The stats don't lie. David Dahl is a beast over the last three, I mean, over the last two weeks. I'd say he definitely gets an upgrade, and he's probably going to go gold. Next up, Lindor. Lindor, daddy's definitely getting an upgrade. He's got, he's already at 83K. He's going to go to 88, 89. Um, here are the stats, man. He's 30, he's 17 for 48, beastly average, four dingers, eight RBIs, one stolen base, Six walks for seven strikeouts. That's amazing. And he has four doubles. Oh, my. Yeah. Yeah, he's getting upgraded. Next up. Oh, I might as well just call him the MVP again because he's the best player in baseball. And it's Christian Yelich, man. Oh, my God. He literally. He's 17 for 41 over the last two weeks. Oh, he has three dingers. Two doubles. Nine singles. 17 hits. And, yeah. But guys, you know what? I gotta say one thing though. And who do I think is going diamond? Who do I think is definitely going diamond? And I think it's time to say it. Ronald Ocona. He's gonna go diamond. I literally guarantee it. He's at 8K. I have 13. Yo, listen to me. Ronald Ocona is about to go diamond uh here it is man he is 50 for 54 but he has four dingers and he has four dingers this week only he had a bad last week but this week he has four dingers a grand slam he has 11 rbis and all the rbis were off home runs so what gets upgraded yo his power might go to a freaking 99 also murphy i th i think is gonna go silver again um murphy is batting beastly over the last two weeks he's batting about 400 his stats are amazing, and I think he goes gold again. If you guys could pick him up, I would pick him up. I say he goes gold again. But let's keep going. Uh, Eduardo Escobar, man. He's still beasting, bro. I still don't understand how he's, like, he's beasting. He's going to go to a 79.80. He deserves it. He's beasting and feasting. His stats suck, too. So I really think he goes up in price. Next up, I already talked about this card. Oh, oh, did I forget to mention? Trey freaking Turner. He's at 3K. We have six. Thank the Lord. Trey Turner is back, and he freaking went off last night. Um, here are the stats over the last two weeks. 18 for 53, uh, three dingers, two triples, three doubles, seven singles, eight ribbies, two stolen bases, three walks for 15Ks. Yo, he's getting upgraded. Uh, Trey Turner's back in action. Next up, Moustakis. Um, here it is, man. Moustakis and Austin Meadows. Uh... Moustakis goes gold, no doubt. I'm not even going to read the stats. I just want to get out as many players as I think is going to go gold. If I'm saying, like, I have all the stats right here. 
Like it's on Yahoo Fantasy. It, like it's all like the stats are all right here. If you don't believe me, I don't care. Um, Mike Mustak is a top twenty over the last two weeks. He's a top ten over the last two weeks. He has to go gold. Um, next up, Trevor Story. Does Trevor Story go diamond this update? I say Story, Okuna, and Xander all have chances of going diamond. I really think Story and Okuna go diamond though. I have twenty stories. I got all of them for twenty five two k. So I'm valid. I'm gonna make a ton of stubs. Trevor Story's been going off the last two weeks uh, and the last month realistically. Um, Freddie Freeman could get another upgrade. Howie Kendrick. Okay, I don't even know what overall he is. I didn't even know he was doing good, but he's 102 stubs. Not a bad investment. Pretty cheap, and I he could go silver. Honestly, he's playing really freaking good over the last two weeks. He has really good stats. Next up, uh, Lucas Giolito. I think everybody knows about Lucas Giolito right now, and Ryu as well. Uh, Lucas Giolito is 775 stubs. Just stay away from the car, but yeah, he's going to get an upgrade. Next, we got Ryu. Um, let's see if he's still cheap. I'm pretty sure I have a lot of him. 3,600 stubs. I have four, so I'm valid. Um, if you guys didn't get him, I mean, he could go diamond. I doubt it, though. Next up, we got Moran, and we got Meadows. Uh, Moran on the Pirates. He's been beasting and feasting, man. Um, yeah, and his edge is down right now. For 65 stubs, I'll go ahead and pick him up. You can make a ton of stubs off a of bronze card. Definitely worth it. Next up, man, uh, Austin Meadows. He's just, he's a beast, bro. He's at 600 stubs. I say he goes gold. If you could snag him for 500 stubs, like, just, just wait on him. Wait, like, two weeks, three weeks, four weeks, whatever. Wait a month, and you'll make a ton of stubs. That's what I think. Austin Meadows has been a beast. Uh, yeah, honestly, let's check out let's check out some pitchers now. Uh, let's get into starting pitchers. So, Giolito. Okay, this is one guy that nobody knows about. So, I don't know. This guy, Samson, on the Rangers. He's at 27 stubs. I bought six yesterday for five stubs. If you're watching this, try to get more. Um, like, this is a very, very good card. I mean, he's not a good card, but he's playing very, very good. So I recommend him. I recommend Jake Orderizzi or Odizzi. I don't know how to say his name. I'm an idiot, but uh, here he is. He's already at 1,100 stubs. He's going to be gold, but I don't think you should pick him up. Uh, just don't pick him up. Next up. We got Charlie Morton Daddy. Um, here it is. Charlie Morton. 4K as an 83 gold. People really think he's going diamond. And honestly, the stats, he's 3 and over the last two weeks. Yeah, he's going diamond. Honestly, he deserves to go diamond with those stats. Next up, uh, Kyle Hendricks, man. He's getting an upgrade. 100%. Um, he's been pitching gems. Like, he's been really pitching gems. 835 stubs. I say he goes gold. 100% goes gold. Um, Nick Pavetta. Actually playing good is about time. That's interesting. Nick Pavetta. Okay, and he's a silver. You know, this is a pretty good card to buy. Uh, it's a good investment. He's a top five pitcher over the last two weeks. If he gets an upgrade, you're lit. Uh, Ryu gets an upgrade. Scherzer gets an upgrade. And I say... Samson, Martin, Hendricks, Strasburg, Strasburg. Strasburg's been playing very well as well. Strasburg deserves an upgrade. Let's see, where is Strasburg? Strowman is playing crappy. 10, 10, all right, yeah. His price already went up, as you can see, so that's a good card to get. Let's look at relief pitchers. Let's see if there's any relievers that stand out. Let's see, over the last 14 days, all players. Let's see. So, okay. Brad Hand is actually one of the top relief pitchers over the last 14 days. So, maybe Brad Hand could finally get that upgrade. Uh, Brad Hand has been really good. He's been really good. And Brad Hand, here it is. 1,300 stubs. Um, over the last two weeks, he, had, he's six, he has seven innings pitched and six saves over the last two weeks with 10 strikeouts. So... So that's interesting. And he has no earned runs. So that's very good to hear. Honestly, one of the only relief pitchers I really think would go up is Brad Hands. That Samson guy. And Sean Doolittle hasn't been too bad either. And honestly, guys, that's all I got for you. I hope you guys enjoyed my upgrade video. If you guys don't dis if you guys disagree with something, drop it in the comments. Let my people know that like uh, I missed some players, but I pretty much went over all of them. I know Kenta Marte is still doing good. 
And just make sure you listen to me. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one. Peace. Hey, yo,